we couldn't get any trucks in, any trucks out. Like he was right in front of the, the, the check-in? Right in the center. So yeah. they got a, t a rig, and tow, tow rigger. I came got it. Yeah. Was it like a tow rig that came picked it up, or did he get it fixed? No, I don't know. That. He had a tow rig. Tow rig came got him? Dang. It must have been hard to pull him through and then turn him around, too. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you got two rain jackets. Where's mine? <laughs> Thank you guys for all the stuff you sent me at the PO box today. I think I know what this one is because it makes noise like a. Oh yeah, we got Cobra Kai here. Okay, so why are your lips all blue? So we might have. Oh, we, we <laughs> might have a load um, going out to Alabama. We don't know, but we're checking on it now. But this loads are bad. I had a, I had a coloring pot. You have a coloring pot? It's like wow. it's double colors. That is crazy. That is awesome. Thanks for our raincoat, though. For oh, yeah. So what you saw. Glad it's not raining at all out here. <laughs> you have a raincoat. Oh, gosh. Uh, I'm going to go back to Target and get one. Walmart didn't have any, so let's see if we get this load, though. And we got a bunch of groceries. Tonight is three doors down. She bought two of them. One for Megan Hopper. Yeah, uh, none for me. Okay. Oh, yeah. Hi, Tiki. What have you been doing, dude? Do you hear the sound check in the backyard? What song were they just playing? Uh, I, don't, I don't actually know what song it was, but it sounded really good. Oh, what are those shoes that I got? No, the, the white ones. Guys, I forgot what uh, Air Ups, I think these were called. Yes, remember these guys? These are like a knockoff and one version. Yes, Kaysen's rocking these. These will be uh, brown in a little bit, but... Okay. Let's open Let these turn, up. Like, yellow. Let's open these up. Show, yeah, show these out. <laughs> Bam. And then I got these. Tiki's outside. We are gonna play blues. Blue. Oh goodness. All right, that's what we got. Oh, I got even Oh, and I got this for some battle right here, guys. Some serious yeah. battle that's going down right here. What do you think about this, T Dubs? I'm excited. No, look. I know. I'm excited. You think you're gonna? How many think you're gonna win? I actually don't know where my cutter is right now, so I'm just gonna. Okay. Do it. This, I think this is for the kids. This is when I was guessing on the. Uh, I'm guessing on the cars. Hot Wheels. Oh, that's what I think, too. Oh, yeah. Oh. Wait a second. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It says Hot Wheels right on the side. So whoever said this, thank you so much. See, it is from... This is awesome. The kids are going to be so excited. Oh, yeah. 15 vehicles. Oh. Enjoy your gift. Hi, Justin. These are for the boys. Oh, thank and you. And I sent you something for your Volvo and W9. Thank you so much. Jason Pettit. Thank Jason you, Jason. Jason Pettit. Thank you, man. The kids are going to be so excited. I got to go pick up this low, but we're going to try and get these open real quick. We'll be careful. It's open. It's sharp. Box number two. Surprise. Well, kason has got a new game he's playing right now. Otherwise, he'd be the over here. Game, yeah. Oh, wow. They're like individually packaged. Oh, that's cool. Heck yeah. Oh, oh. oh. Yes, thank you so much. <laughs> awesome. Was it? <laughs> Who said that? This is from uh, John. Casey, R. come check this out. Seriously, dude, that is that's hilarious. awesome, John. Thank you. You're awesome. Yes. For He's, me? For you and your brothers? For you and your brothers, you get pick one. Well, uh, whose name is it? Mike? Who sent these? No, Jason Sorry. Pettit. Jason Pettison. Yes. Thank you, Jason. Thank you so much. Which one are you choosing, Case? Bug. What's in that bag? I don't know. Like I'm nervous to like. There you go. This is pretty hilarious, though. This one. What is that? Oh, oh that. thank you. What is that? You are the man. Oh, this one now. oh there's a note. There's it's a note. black. Oh, yes. Thank you. Her. Thank you. Because the one I have is white. You are awesome. Whoever yes. sent this? Yes. Oh. Okay, take him over there. Play your game. This is from Kenny Walker. Say thank you, Jason. All right. Here's the black one you said no, on the live is... feed Wednesday night you wish you had. It should fit the iPad. Thank you so much. For. If not, That's exactly like the one I have. I love the content, man. I love the family. Keep yeah. doing all you do. Thank you, Kenny. Oh, Thanks, dude, Kenny. That's awesome. I, that white I just I wish you could have seen his clashed. face. Just I don't know. Know. Okay, go open your car. Make really, sure you put the packaging away. I really wish you could have seen his face. And these are things for the bowl, that's awesome. Thank you. Yeah, I don't... So I told T-Dubs to get candy at Walmart. She didn't get it. I told T-Dubs to get candy at Target. Sorry, kids. There's no candy for you this year. Candy. Whoever comes to the door this year, no candy for you. First of all, I will get candy by Halloween. And maybe I'll pick up a raincoat. Oh, yes. Thank you. 22s for the uh, Volvo. Awesome, awesome. And guys, we've actually nice. decided to list it. It's on Facebook Mar Marketplace right now. Uh, the high offer is 42 for it. We're asking 47.5. If you're interested in it. Oh, yes. Two sets? 
Oh no! Oh no! He gave me 18s. Yeah. Thank you, man. Aww. So he said these are for the Dub Nine, W Nine, and for the Volvo. That's awesome. Thank you, man. I, I think that that must be from Keith as well because yeah. he said he said something for the for Volvo and the truck. Thanks a lot, oh, thank man. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna get this load oh, Jason. going. Jason. Jason, thanks a lot, Jason. I'm gonna get the load going, and thank you so much for this too. That's awesome. Love you guys. And uh, Volvo's for sale, guys. We just. I want to spend time with the kids. Uh, if I run a carry right now, I'm going to be pulled in another direction of taking more time away. So that'll come probably four or five years down the road when, when Tank's in school. So, yep. yep. Right now, what was up for sale? God bless you guys. Pat him, Casey. <laughs> <laughs> pet him again. Yeah. Give him pets. Give him pets. Give him pets. Uh, <laughs> like, no, 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 boots is getting big. He doesn't need to be on that table, by the way. Kryptonite was just getting... Sound check I'm is excited. going. Yeah. Rain or shine, right? Earlier, they were, yeah, rain or shine. Yeah, they, the only time they ever cut the concerts is if um, there's thunder and lightning. Oh. Oh, look, there's a snail over here. He's alive, dude. Look at his little tentacles. Oh, you see him? There you go. All right, I gotta get to pick this thing up. Go for it, boots. See ya. I don't like that. Give me a kiss. I'm out. I'll be All back right. in a couple hours. <laughs> Megan Hopper would be here about five, I right? Know. Pizza. Pizza, but I'm kind of over pizza. Well, Italian? That's your guys' thing. You figured out. Bye. Bye. Check out those rain boots. Jeez Louise. All right. Got all kinds of stuff on top of the race truck. Check out just trucking.shop, please, guys. This truck will be given away in December. And Jason, Keith, all you guys, thank you so much for everything you've given us. Uh, we truly appreciate it. I'm going to get that thing going. Or at least see where it's going to fit on the W9. And then we got all this stuff. Thank you, guys. Let's get going. Let's get her fired up. So, yes, she is for sale. 47.5 is uh, what we're starting at. Highest offer right now is 42. So, we'll see what we get. A couple offers of 40 and one offer of 42. But this guy needs to get warm. And we'll get going. <laughs> squeaky seat. I hope it just stops randomly one day. Squeaky, squeaky seat. I don't know what the heck is squeaking. I lubed everything. We'll see. So I am thinking right next to the green APU, we already have bolts right here for it. So we'll have to drill into the back, get some big washers and some big bolts. And that's going to be perfect. That should be an easy install once we get the hardware. And look how much room you get, guys. $300 on eBay. All that room for storage, for tools, and whatever else you need on the road. Okay, perfect. And maybe like you guys were saying, it was the rain because it's lighting up now. I don't know. I'm not putting it back together until we feel good about it. And we'll try and fit our boost gauge in there. And thank you so much for this black holder for the iPad. That's going to be awesome instead of the white. And what do you know, guys? Our fabrication skills worked out just perfectly. Flush. That is awesome. Now I just got to get it wired up for a bulb. We have boost. I love it. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's get up here to pick up. And we're going to cross over 85 and about six more miles up to Pleasantburg and there's our our exit past the focus real quick. Maybe they're on their phone, maybe they're just driving slow. Yeah, on the phone, of course. I saw them through the window. Clouds are kind of gloomy, but t Dub just sent me a little video I'll show you right here. Boys found some rocks while they were waiting for cash to go from school. But where she's at, there's some sun peeking through. To my left, there's some, uh, some holes in the clouds, but not really, uh, not, not a huge break, so we'll see what happens. But maybe we'll get some stuff in this concert, but I'm excited about a little bit of Kryptonite. It's an awesome song that I remember growing up, Three Doors Down. And then tomorrow night's NF. Uh, not, I've heard a couple of songs, like them uh, a little bit. Got somebody chatter on the uh, CB. We're only going 60 miles an hour. Everybody else is just kind of creeping along, I guess. And don't think I'm speeding. I'm just chilling. 
and the truck is currently getting after those couple loads. We're at 7.7 .7 miles per gallon still. And this is a light load, 20,000 going over to Alabama. Oh, that guy's getting over. Let me go ahead. And, all right, you gonna come up or am I gonna have to put some turn and burn on? No, you're coming up, okay. Come on, because I need to get in that right lane. Let's go, Cherokee. They had the blessing to get a load. Uh, they were offered it at 15, I offered 21.50. He said he could get 17, I said 18.50 and, and send it over. It took him a while, I think about 10 minutes, but he's like, I helped Cat got it. And, uh, so we've got 18.50 on 350 miles. Not too bad, but I definitely noticed a little, little bit of a shift in the market. I don't know if it's the containers out of California, just not a lot of freight hitting the states right now, but uh, it just seems like there's not a lot out there that needs to move right now. So and it's coming into peak season, coming into the holiday. So we got to see what's going on, but we're blessed to get some more, uh, probably glue, going over to Alabama for a packaging company. And then we'll get some concerts in for the next two days out with the boys that tomorrow morning maybe get some maybe get those steps put on it's gonna be awesome those steps are gonna line up perfectly with those four bolt four holes just gotta go get some hardware maybe i'll do that tomorrow and then i gotta uh that visor looks like it's gonna be quite the task because i have to take off this whole headliner piece up here where the cb is where the visors are where the speakers are if i'm gonna be drilling in i unless yeah i have to come to the back side i'm sure for some nuts so that's gonna be a little bit of a project uh, but the rear lights, I can do that, I wouldn't say quickly, but while I'm putting on that step, I can probably get those rear lights wired up. Because it's only three wires that they're already all wired, pre-wired, so that's pretty awesome. You don't gotta wire individual lights. You just get those three wires plugged in and uh, it'll all light up, look pretty cool. I always like seeing those in the back of these nice trucks. So I wouldn't say my truck is a nice truck, but it's definitely a comfortable, fun truck. And I'm excited about the boost gauge. I'll probably go down to Hay Guy for my next oil change, Hay Guy Diesel in Griffin, Georgia. Look them up if you have a Cummins. They specialize in the good ISX, the 871s, the N14s, all that good stuff. Uh, all the Cummins motors, but typically the ISX, they uh, do the most of. But I'll go down there because Allison's done a couple of these boost gauges, so I'll let her get some video time with me and, and collaborate with her in the shop and get that boost gauge hooked up. And then I ordered another, they don't sell just those sleeves that go behind the gauges, that little plastic piece that is brittle and breaks. I tried to find them, I called the P-Store, I called them MHC Kenworth, they don't sell them, they only sell the whole gauge. So I'm either going to have to make something or put a little lip on that plastic, but I did just go ahead and buy a new gauge, a fuel filter for $100, and it's hard to find a brand new one, but I did find a brand new one. And then that'll come with that little sleeve that is what cracks, so I'll be able to put that back, and then for my air, I might just build up a little bit of a lip on it so it doesn't fall through with some epoxy or something. And, uh, then the gauges should be back to good. But thanks for all the input you guys put in the comments about when it rains, these trucks, the gauges freak out a little bit. And also, I do believe it's a sending unit for that uh, fuel gauge. So we might as well do both sending units just so they're both fresh and brand new. I just have to get the part numbers of what I need because I looked online, but it's up to 2011. And my truck's 2012, so <laughs> we're gonna have to look into that. But here's our exit, we'll go cut through. Uh, Bob Jones University area, Taco Casa, and then we will take a left and be there at the ankle. They, they ship till 3.30. This lady is always pretty nice and awesome, so I'm sure she'll get me loaded pretty quickly. And we'll be back home for the weekend. Back at ankle. Uh-oh, someone's crossing the streets. You might be talking to him, so. Alright, alright. Walking the tracks, there you go. Uh oh, hey. Calm it down. Let's keep going. Watch out for the trains, buddy. Okay, alright. Goodness gracious, that seat. Can't stand it. <sighs> Someday I'll figure out the squeak. Just replace the whole base of it. And it's just about 3 o'clock, so we should be good to go. Ankle. Hey, 
vehicle going to Tuscaloosa. Yes, sir. Pick it up. Justin. Tuscaloosa, Alabama. Tuscaloosa, Alabama. <laughs> All right, thank you very much. Two through five, like we're always at. I recognize the lady's voice on the walkie-talkie. It's the same one that always takes care of us, so. She's pretty quick, it's only 20,000 pounds, so. Probably getting those big totes. This is the first time I've had a W9 here, though. We have something going on. Looks like he's moving, though. He was just backing up, but I think he's moving. A uh, little trash truck, unless he's gonna re- Situate, pick up another can. I don't know. No, looks like he's just going. All right. So we're going to try and stay nice and wide to the left. Get our trailer over here and then cut over because the Volvo did this somewhat decently, but the W9 is a lot longer. So set up our trailer against this curb. Over here. Cut it around because we have to back in all the way over there. This should work out just fine. Let's see. Oh my gosh, the two trucks already back there, too. That trailer gonna get around a little bit. Let's see. Come on, before we put our tires off in the ditch. Now, there's gonna be a couple turns here because <laughs> the trailer did not go over. It's almost over, but not really. I had to get over here more and then try to get the trailer to come back over on the blind side because that trailer was not coming over for us. And we're almost going to make it, but not quite. So we'll do a little pull up. Oh, five second gear. Then we should be able to get straight. And here we go. A little bit different than the whole But we got it. Trailer straight now. Now it's just backing up. Looks like we'll open our doors here because there's a guy back there who is uh, still working on his. Oh, he's in there. So we'll go door six. Oh no, we'll go door five. There we go. Let's get this on the truck. We couldn't get any trucks in, any trucks out. Uh, he was right in front of the, the check-in. Right in the center. Yeah. So they got a, a rig, yeah, a tow, they got, tow they rigger. They got back out because you ended up here. I came got it. Yeah. Was it like a tow rig that came picked it up or did he get it fixed? No, I don't know. He had a tow rig. Tow rig came got him? Oh, Dang. Yeah. It must have been hard to pull him through and then turn him around too. Oh, yeah. yeah Woo. All right, I'll be out there. Thank you. If you heard it right there, uh, Earlier, there was a guy picking up this load, and poor guy, his truck broke down right there in the check-in gate, so T's and P's for him, but the rig had to pull him. I can't imagine him turning him around in that little area. <sighs> but here we go. Put our little lock on there, and we'll get this Tuscaloosa on Monday. So what I'm doing for right now, I'm using this electrical tape, which is like, um, doesn't have that sticky residue to it. Yeah, I don't um, know. Kind of so looks like this. Take it as a, as a good thing, right? Are we loaded up already? That was quick. You like my new truck? Is this a new one? Yeah, the other one was black. I like the, I like the John, uh, the, the, the Volvo version. There you go, I had it on the other one too. I'll tell you something about these trucks of the Volvo, like I have gauges breaking on this uh -huh. thing. Like, so is this a new one that you just this, purchased? This is gonna be the one that's gonna be the, the future now. Oh yeah? Yep, and then I'm selling that black one. Are you really? Yeah, you I just- you have a buyer for it? I got a couple guys I put it on Facebook yesterday. Uh -huh. But I just don't trust anybody to drive it for me. Right. So I'm just like, I'm just gonna get rid of it. Well, it's, you know, I got a guy, uh, a good friend of mine, he, he lives in the neighborhood with me. Uh -huh. And he drives from the north. Yeah, a lot of people and, around here do. Uh, he's trying to get his own truck. His own truck. And, uh, the premium's yeah, so, it's just, it's just, they're so expensive right now. Yeah. Like if I could buy, because I own a trailer too, if I could have bought another trailer, it would have made some sense because I could have booked loads like I book them. Yeah. But they're so expensive. That trailer was twenty grand, nineteen thousand five hundred a year and a half ago, and now it's like forty grand now. Yeah, that's so crazy. So I'm like, hey, if the market's that good, let's just sell the truck. Right. Yeah. Let's yeah. just get it out of here. That's crazy. But this truck, uh, like, 
Gage is breaking, all kinds of crazy stuff going on. But we'll get through it. Yeah. Because it, it's, it's like an apartment back here, though. Like, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's so it big back like there. It's a lot bigger than, yeah. than the one that you have. And I got the interior all redone. Like, I did the leather seats and everything. Yeah. Look, look at these seats. And so you work on them yourself and stuff. Well, yeah. I get them all redone. Like, I had all the leather space and there with the other Nice. Ones. Okay, we got our seal and we are loaded. And like I was saying, I'm wrapping it around the outside of it. Um, and that is giving it tension so it stays put. So I already got the air one done, get this one done. And I have a new one of these coming just in case the light starts going off again. We'll see. And also I checked the um, sending unit right now. The actual plug for the sending unit has a bunch of water in it. So that could be part of it. It could be the sending unit and that, but I got as much of the water out as I can. And I'll wrap that too and put it up in an area where it won't be getting water. So let's put this gauge in and then let's go put our seal on and get home. I'll tell you what, at least for the time being, it's lighting up. We've got boost in there. It was a little bit off, so I, I kinked a little bit to where I liked it. And uh, our air filter's back in. So as of right now, we're gauged. We're ready to go. But we have one extra coming. So if anything, we'll have that outside cylinder. And if that keeps going out at night, we'll have a brand new one. So hey, I like my plan comes together. And we have the new black mount. Thank you so much for this. I turned it sideways so I can get it out, but that is gonna work out awesome. It's actually shorter, so it's better because it has less uh, travel, so it'll hold it better. So that's awesome. Thank you so much for that. Let's get home and put our seal on first. Okay, we are ready to go. We are loaded. It's only like six of those toads, so probably less than 20,000 pounds. And a little known fact, this is right off Pleasant Burgers. There's, there's a Sphinx, and I never knew there was truck parking back here, so there's like five spots. So little known secret. Let's go get something to refresh. Got some rain right here, but it looks like that big gray cloud's going over. I don't know, I don't know what to expect for the concert, but we're gonna have fun. Rain or shine, and Megan Hopper, one of our uh, first subscribers ever, uh, she's also the head moderator of our Facebook page, Just Trucking Family. Check it out in there. And if you want to see the Volvo, the ad is on Facebook Marketplace, uh, 29681 is zip code. So. Let's pray for some good, uh, at least decent weather tonight at the concert. Either way, we're going to hear some kryptonite, and we're almost home. Well, we are home, and you know me, can't leave anything alone. So I measured those out, got the two top ones down, but um, I'll do the bottom ones once I get the top ones in there, because I had to measure pretty precisely. I had hardware already from the mud flap hangers that I took off, but they're too long. I need these to be about... Uh, inch and a quarter so and, and fully threaded so I need some washers also some big boy washers so that it's not putting all the tension on the head of the bolt but hey I'll have those on before we take this trip heck yeah and the green APU is set to battery tender so to keep us nice and charged over the weekend but I'm gonna go to Home Depot Megan Hopper should be at the house soon and these are also lockable guys they're super cool so there's keys that come with it so I want that on there I want to get the tools out of here get this off the catwalk and I just have more space. Or I might still keep that for like hoses and stuff. I don't know, but I'll probably move it forward a little bit. Either way, go get some hardware and get that on the frame. Cause you know me and my mind. Well, that is a wrap. Let's get this concert going. Three doors down. Megan's not here yet, but she should be here any minute. Check out Just Truck and Dot Shop. Let's go see what these kids are doing. <laughs> I come in. Cobra Kai, we call him because he's wearing the. Uh, what's it called? Oh, hi, TV and Cobra Kai. Over there. Over this way. Come on. Over there. He's like, what are you talking about? Oh, my goodness. I see you hiding through the window. What are you doing? I was hiding for me. Because uh, you can't have candy? No. I told him you could have candy. Yeah, yeah. Hi, baby. Yeah. I gave him a little candy, Hi, baby. and it wasn't enough candy. Oh, you could have my keys then. So then I told him, he like put the cup down and said, that's not enough. And I said, well... Kaysen? That's whatever you get is plenty. You get what you get. Okay. Don't pitch a fit. Thank you. Oh, big truck? Okay, let's go inside. Megan Hopper should be here in a little bit. What, is she on her way? Oh, close. Okay. Kaysen, come on, baby. Life isn't always about just candy, buddy. Okay. Come on, bubs. Ooh, <laughs> What's up, dude? Dinner. Yeah. Dinner. We have two new games. 
I know. We went to the Walmart and got them. Do you have new controllers too? Yeah. Hello, neighbor Marissa. Hey, Dada. Yes. Could you be a Yoshi? Yes, I can. Let's go play. Yeah, yeah you want truckies? Okay, let's get them. Okay, let's go. If I go crazy, then we used to call me Superman. You guys are on video, by the way. How you doing? Thanks for coming down. Yes, I'm still here. I didn't go anywhere. Yes. I took a shower. What? How you doing? Good seeing you, Megan. Thank you for coming to South Carolina. Of course. I heard you got a present for these little guys. Uh oh. Oh, you already saw your presents. Wow. Wozers, save reds are the way to go. I've got Hot Wheels for you. What do you say? Hey, look. Kyla, Hot Wheels for you. What do you say? Thank you. Good job, baby. And of course we brought candy. Oh, and then yum, some, yum. And then some bigger Hot Wheels for go. everybody. Yes. Yes. What do you want? Want to go? Okay. okay. All right. Well, we're going to we're gonna get down with some uh, three doors down after we get some pizza. Yep. Oh, we're taking a monster truck? All right. Yes, baby. Yes, baby. Oh, you want the big truck keys? You want to start it for him? Of course. Let's start it for him. Got him? Okay, he's got him. We got him. <laughs> All right, well, God bless you guys, and thanks for coming out. We're going to get to some three doors down. Yeah. Yeah, let's go start this thing up. What's up, neighbors? Let's go. You going a little three doors down? Heck yeah. Hey, unlock. Oh. Hey, Gigi Papa just got here. Hiya. Are you going to start it? Start. Go ahead and start. Okay. Start, start. Thank you. Okay. See ya. Wrap, guys. <laughs> See you later. See you on the next one. We're going to get some three doors down going.